Today is the 3rd of May 2016. Looks like we're going to make something. My mom is going to make something. She's going to make me robust for dinner and that's the sunlight for the sunshine. Sunlight sunshine. Of sunlight of the dusk. Mi Jawa is not the same as Mi Rubus. Huh? Mi Jawa is not the same as Mi Rubus. Who cares? They use the same thing, it's the yellow noodles that gives it an alkali taste. Uh, as they say in Cantonese, what's can, what, what do the Cantonese say? Eh? What do, Kan Sui is alkali, right? Kan Sui. What else do you need? You have Kalamansi or Yim of Kasturi or Katzai in Cantonese. You mix it with uh, sugar and and get and get the calamansi juice out. Maybe three of these calamansi uh, balls to make one cup of refreshing lemonade. Then this one is what? Lengkuas. What is lengkuas called in English? Lampyong. That's Cantonese. Lampyong is Cantonese. How about English? Oh, galangal is for curry. Is it? Then there's some lemons there. Then there are uh, boiled eggs and sweet potato for this mi ji. What mi rebus or mi jawa that that you're doing? You're doing what? Either or. Huh? Either or. Either or. Okay, it's the same thing. I thought you said just now it was different. It's a bit different, okay. So this is these are sweet potatoes, Japanese sweet potatoes, not from Japan, but it's called Japanese sweet potatoes. And there are some of these uh, dried chilies that has been soaked in hot water for a few hours, and tofu. Just two of these tofu's. And there are some bean sprouts and some parsley, spring onions, big chilies, green, green chilies. Hopefully it's gonna be yummy. Yummy and easy to do. Is it gonna be easy to do? Easy it's not so easy la, but after you cook the Gravy, then we cook. Mm, the gravy is going to be based on the potato. That potato, but that potato is sweet. Normally, when they were then when they are, I mean, normally they use normal potatoes, the yellow kind, the ones that are not sweet, to make the gravy. Uh, they, they should. They are supposed to use this one, these normal potatoes, instead of the sweet potatoes or the Japanese sweet potato which is really really sweet and inside it is purple so I think instead of uh, getting yellow gravy we will be getting purple gravy instead of yellow gravy we will be getting purple gravy oh you take out the skin for me it's not the skin it's the inside that is inside is uh, yellow, yellow. Oh, okay oops the inside is yellow so the 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 guai the guailo or the Caucasians who live at who bo, who the Caucasians who were born in China and lived in China for a long time. The outside they look white but inside it's yellow. It's like the anti guailo term. Anti guailo term. Or banana. Not a banana. Banana is yellow on the outside and white on the inside so what is white outside and yellow inside is there a vegetable or fruit that that has those characteristics name me a fruit or vegetable that is white on the outside and yellow on the inside potato. what potato is white outside man? sweet potato sweet potato is white outside ah? It's got white skin. Ah. 
I never seen such a potato before. And inside is creamy too. Okay, never mind. <laughs> There's uh, no help at all. Why on the other side? Yellow on the inside. Ah. Yeah, I don't know. Who knows? We have a term for we have a term for Chinese people who do not know how to speak Mandarin, and they are called bananas. That means they are yellow skin. That means they have characteristics characteristics of a Chinese person, but deep down inside they don't know how to speak Mandarin. So they are considered quite low or Caucasian people. I mean, people like a, like the white people because they only know how to speak English. The Japanese sweet potatoes skin has been peeled and this is the result. Yellowish green inside the sweet potato. What's happening here? Ah, the tofu is being slowly fried and the oil is not too hot. Got to turn on the extractor fan. Okay. Why is there meat in this this mi robusto mi jawa? It's supposed to be vegetarian, huh? Oh, this. Oh, this. Okay. So I done already the sweet potato. Thank you. Anything else? Anything else? What? So are you going to mash it up? Yeah, you are. Okay. Mash it. I'm also got to say that the Japanese sweet potatoes were already cooked or steamed. That's why it's soft. So this is so what it looks like, the Japanese sweet, sweet potato after it's been mashed to oblivion. And it's very sweet. The tofu is almost done. Got it being fried. How's that? Dugging. Sabuk dugging? Yeah. Literally, literally translated as as a powder of the meat. Meat powder. Uh, meat curry powder. Meat curry powder. Mm. Curry powder. Okay. Oh, we're gonna use the blender or blitz. What's it called? Food processor, blender, blitzer. What? Mm. All of them. Lengkuas. Smells aromatic and perfumey. There's some garlic there. Lemongrass. And uh, be sure that the mm. the gravy is like so. I mean, it's consists of so many ingredients. Uh, yes. Really, uh, I thought it's just made of sweet potato or some potato. It has to be uh, spicy. Me robust. Wait a minute, no. Me mm. robust is like bland and brown and. Gravy, lead. the water, the soup is thick. Yeah, there's a lot of. Uh, there's a lot of. Uh, Spices. Mm. Okay, it's interesting. So, what happened while I was away? Nothing happened. So, there is that uh, blitz mm. ingredients. What are they? Garlic, onions, galanga. Uh, what powder is that? That give, gives it a red color. Chili. Chili powder. Chili. Not chili. Chili. And lemongrass. Uh, lemongrass, chili. And chili, the dried uh, chili. Dried uh, prawn. Dried prawn also inside. Dried Galangal, prawn. Uh, ginger.
I see the fried tofu has been chopped or sliced into pieces. What else is going to happen? I wonder. So we're cooking the gravy now in a pot. There is some oil in it. So what are the steps? Pour in the, the, the blitzed ingredients. Onions, galanga, garlic, ginger, uh, dried chili, lemongrass. Oh. Uh -huh. Dried prawns. And dried prawns. How come I didn't see any dried prawns just now in your ingredients? Oh, ingredients. Oh, okay. Never mind. After that, after doing whatever you're doing now, you're just, uh, what? just frying it up. Now this uh, curry powder, meat curry powder. It's yeah. a weird term. There's no meat in it. Hey, it's for meat, for cooking meat. Curry powder meat. used for cooking meat. Okay. What's the next step? Put in the water. And? And then you can put in the rest of the... The rest of the ingredients mm -hmm. are? Uh, the mashed potato. Most mashed Japanese sweet potato. And? Finish. Pork stock? Oh, this one. I thought you were boiling the, the pieces of pork just to get rid of the scum. Yeah. it. But in fact, you were like, you want the, the stock of the pork. Mm. One cup of water. From a diarrhea looking mess to a watery mess. Next up, mashed Japanese sweet potato. Looking ingredient now makes us in with the <laughs> diarrhea looking ingredient. Hey, what about your stock? Your pork stock? In the west, they have a chicken stock, vegetable stock, fish stock, but I've never seen them selling pork stock or mentioned in the in the food programs. Huh? They don't sell pork stock, right? Why? Nobody wants Nobody pork stock. Wants to buy. You do it yourself. Mm. Cool. Chicken stock, mostly. Beef stock, yes. Other stocks? Fish stock, uh -huh. yes. Fish, uh, they exist. Stock. Vegetable stock as well. Very expensive. Well, even chicken stock can be 18 ringgit for one liter. Hey, the consistency it seems like it's not me robust or me jawa. It's water. a bit too orange. It's supposed to be yellow. No, me jawa, me robust is this color. Really? Yeah. Mm. Of course, they. Oh, the me jawa that you. Wait, wait. Me jawa was the one that we ate at L and L. Uh, L and L one is. Uh, me jawa. Like. like it's uh, me jawa, right? Yeah. Like, you know, potato is yellowish. So this is mirabus. This is hotter, eh? 
seems to be since you put curry into it. So what's next? Lumps. So boil it for how long? Oh really? That's simple. Huh? That's simple. Huh? That's simple. Yeah. And the uh, yellow noodles need to be like boiled in hot water for just a while because it's already cooked and it's soft and oily. Uh, the process of boiling it also gets rid of the yeah, oil. The boil, huh? Lunch the meat. Lunch the meat. The eggs are ready. The, the, the protein component of the mee rebus or mee java, whatever you call this. This one is a very confusing, confused vegetable, uh, confused dish. Some uh, sh fried shallots that supp is supposed to be crunchy and delectable is this one is the homemade version that I made myself which is black and soft so that will be used for this mi rebus or you translate mi rebus literally to English it's, it means boiled noodles rebus is boiled mi means noodles I hope I'm making myself feel because I'm very very tired for the past couple of days and I can't like speak English like an Englishman. I'm speaking English like a Manglishman. Like Manglish, Malaysian English, which is full of grammatical errors. Maybe you should teach your son how to use. Yes, it's all written in A-F-L-F-F. Oh, okay. Okay, oh, give me 20 minutes. Huh? Mm. All 20 minutes. If you really go for a ride, you'll do A-1, F-1. Alright. Later. No pressure. No pressure, that means it's not today. No pressure, yes, yeah. Boiled eggs have been sliced in half. Meat and pork has been sliced to pieces. Sliced into pieces. There's a pot of water here. Isn't that a too much water just to boil the noodles. And how are you going to use it? Okay, I think it's a waste of water and gas. Yeah. Never mind, it's okay. Can you tell me exactly. Okay, never mind. For the noodles. Garnish here, parsley, green chilies, fried tofu, bean sprouts, calamansi, lime cut in half to sprinkle over the soup or the gravy, pork, egg. And that's all and lastly the, the gravy which is, this doesn't look like gravy for the mi java or mi rebus. And that's it. It's awesome. Kalama Sila. What do you want? Oh, the pork. So does it taste like mi rebus or mi java? No? Yes? Yes or no? How is it? 
Different now. Huh? Yep. Should be different. Outside. Very different. Totally different. Should be. The kwa is not like just sweet potato. So? So? Ah, the prawn smell. Some shallots. Okay. So it tastes, tastes better with the caramelized shallots mm. or onions and celery. You put more of this, What? Celery. 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 And spring onions as well. Very different. This more calamansi line. I think so. <laughs> Sell? It's different. Totally different. Too much too much. Too much. Too much. Curry powder. Look at people put curry powder one. No way. You can buy no way. What kind of recipe is this? But it doesn't taste like it. It's supposed to be sweet. The, the kwang. The baby. This is called sweet already. Uh. I didn't add more sugar. Maybe it's not as sweet as the one in uh, LNL. Hardly any tomato. Chunk of it. 